Nice shorts. Diamonds in Minecraft are both a status symbol and a useful item. Before netherite, they were the best for gear, weapons, and tools. They are commonly used as a form of currency, and just making piles of the blocks is a flex. This is largely because it has to be mined, or maybe you find a few in a chest. But there are no farms for it. In real life, diamonds are also status symbols, even if it's unwarranted. But we actually do have farms for them, and they are incredibly useful minerals. Coal in Minecraft is one of the early resources you seek out to start cooking and smelting, the beginning of progression to more advanced materials. In real life, it's been used by humans throughout history, but our thirst for it has skyrocketed since the Industrial Revolution. If you are new here, I'm Nice, and I'm a geologist. In this video, we will talk both about diamonds and coal, where do we find them in Minecraft, as well as in real life. How do they form? When did they form? And what are their properties? I'm going to cover both, not because they are related to each other in the game or in real life, but because they are related in people's minds. There is this misconception in real life that you can just squeeze coal enough and it becomes diamonds. In Minecraft, they are almost exclusive to each other when you go mining. As you dig down, coal stops and diamonds start. Maybe this is trying to say that the carbon that makes up the coal is the same that makes up the diamonds. They are both composed of carbon, but they have two very different origins. 